Thank you. We can put on All righty. Well, let's get uh, the recommending uh, committee meeting to order uh, November 19th, 10 a.m. Uh, order. We're in compliance with the open meeting law as usual. Thank you. Item number three, bill number 2018-53 for possible action amends the Town Center Development Standards Manual to delete and replace map six. Thereof, which describes street clarifications for streets and other right-of-ways within the town center plan area sponsored by Mr. Summerfield. Hi. All right. Not Mr. Summerfield. Okay. So this is basically from past actions by the council and public works project. Um, this has been basically a cleanup. Uh, this will uh, clarify existing classifications and the proposed classification based on those past actions, and we brought this forward, we planning brought this forward for the Department of Public Works to receive your approval. Does this affect all wards? This is specific to the town center um, special area. That's the town center in Summerlin? In Ward 6. In Ward 6? Yeah. Oh, oh, up in the uh, north, okay. I have a question on that. If you're, why is it, you know, I'm, when I came in here seven years ago, 18B, the Arts District, had outlined exactly what they wanted, nothing more, nothing less, and every little ad, even if it was an innocent and welcome kind of thing, had to be done with a text amendment, took forever. Is that what happens with Town Center? That kind of place where it has a limited list of uses, and then you beg for others? Yes, uh, Town Center has a prescribed list of permits to be used within the uh, standards manual. Um, and if any additional uses uh, are requested, uh, they would have to be done through text amendment, as you said. Okay, I got, obviously got plenty for me, maybe not for Council of but okay. That's all I had to ask. Okay, this is a public hearing. Anybody want to speak on this? I'll close the public hearing. Uh, we'll go right ahead. This is your word. Yeah, motion to approve. Okay, we have a motion to approve. <coughs> All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Motion carries unanimously. This will go to the uh, City Council meeting on November 21st. Uh, bill number 2018-54 for possible action amends various provisions of the Unified Development Code to authorize as a home occupation the breeding of domestic dogs and cats under specific circumstances, sponsored by Councilman Soroka. Who wants to present this? So I, I don't, I'm not sure what this is. Um, once again, we belong to the record. Uh, so this basically uh, piggybacks the previous ordinance for the breeding. Um, this places it within the home occupation oh. section. Mm -hmm. uh, if uh, existing uh, individuals with animal handling licenses that would be able to breed, they would be able to do it through a home occupation permit. Uh, this would allow for only the breeding of dogs and cats. Um, no more than two customers may be present on the property at any one time to maintain the residential character of the neighborhood. Uh, and the use must comply with the animal control regulation. Um, so they can't do that today? Um, they're under. I think there's uh, there's a particular license in which they can do, but this um, marries up to it. I, I think it just basically clarifies uh, the intents for home breeders and um, basically takes the licensing and makes it into a home base. And I think it would affect yeah. 56 individuals within the city wide. Okay. All right. This is a public hearing. Anybody want to speak on this? <laughs> I move for approval. <laughs> okay. I have a motion to approve. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Against? Motion carries unanimously. That will be heard on the November 21st, 2018 City Council meeting. Item number five, citizen participation. Anyone want to participate today? All right. We're done. Motion are adjourned. Thank you. Are down. No eye contact. Yeah.